spell upon my lover I've learned the style that cover Use all your magic charm Here we go You and I And I'm much fair To the time To touch the share Words of Artificial intelligence. What uh, what should we mean about that? Um, this is not. This is real, real things. So um, nowadays, uh, a lot of uh, software is being released from various uh, vendors uh, regarding this and. Uh, what got me thinking was that I got a mail from uh, Sonarworks, uh, which is a uh, is a pretty advanced uh, software uh, made for head headphones and uh, correcting unevenness in your uh, sound due to problems in your room, etc. And they uh, offered me. <laughs> You could buy into this, uh, drop your song in here, and we can tell you if it's going to be a hit or not. Well, Waze have a similar thing, I don't know what the name is, but uh, and I see uh, politicians are uh, standing up and saying uh, everybody needs to learn this because this is the future. Uh, I hope it's not uh, too close future because I don't really want to be... Uh, a slave to this kind of uh, system. Uh, I think uh, music is one thing. It's fairly uh, non-destructive and uh, it's not dangerous in any form or way. But when we let the machine start to tell us what to do, uh, I, I think it's uh, a big uh, stop sign. Because now we really need to think about what we're doing uh, i mean we are starting to get cars that drive without a driver uh, it's probably good if everybody had one um i think now it's the time to be extremely selective about what we're going to use this for i mean in the medical industry it's probably a good thing because it's very predictable uh but uh, uh, in the arms industry, I think it's a very destructive uh, tool, and uh, 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 the argument they use is that they can more directly target what, what they want to shoot on, and who they want to kill, etc. And uh, uh, first of all, I don't want to kill anyone. Second of all, uh, we've seen examples of uh, they hit schools and hospitals, and they, they always claim it's an accident. So, uh, and I'm sure this kind of technology has been in the hands of the bad guys for a while. I mean the military uh, uh, for a while, and uh, the bad guys will soon catch up. So, uh, really? Do we want this? Do we want our kids to rely on machinery instead of learning to ride a simple ride a bi bicycle, climb a tree, whatever, fell down? feel the pain uh, we are a little overprotective uh, with our kids uh, because and i see the point but uh, you all have to fall a couple of times before you learn to to go and that's uh, true in every aspect of life so uh, artificial intelligence uh, the name alone scares the shit out of me and uh, it starts to remind me that, uh, or it looks like we're starting to living. Um, yeah, I haven't seen this film, but Star Wars, uh, The Empire Strikes Back, uh, Terminator kind of thing. This is uh, not a good development, and, uh, in my opinion. And I have to emphasize that everything I say here is based on my scare for this kind of thing, and uh, it's probably. Gonna go fine as almost anything do, but 
we're in the brink of a third world war it looks like and uh, i think it's quite possibly the most scary thing i've uh, encountered so far and i didn't think i was gonna see uh, that happen and uh, i think we are probably a little bit too naive as uh, normal uh, citizens in uh, most of Western Europe. And uh, I think we uh, take decisions based more upon uh, more upon practical things than uh, actual necessary things. So uh, everything has a big cost attached to it, but it's uh, more expensive to leave things as they are and continue on the path they're already, already going down. So, uh, but music lives, concerts lives so far. Uh, but the first thing they cut when they're gonna make their budgets is uh, the cultural um, sector. I mean music, theater, whatever, uh, and uh, it's not necessarily a bad thing because uh, we have to think ourselves and uh, take our market ourselves, etc. And uh, don't rely on uh, government or states are gonna use a lot of money for our stuff, but uh, I think it's time that we start to take back some of the 70s feel and uh, and uh, let the politicians do what the hell they want to do. But uh, the problem is that we select them ourselves. So we can't really complain about these guys because they are there because of us. They, they can't get much done because uh, everything is a compromise and uh, they want to do what's best for them. So uh, maybe AI is the thing for the future in the... Uh, how we run a country in certain levels, business-wise, but on a feeling, feeling level, it's not, in my opinion. I think we're uh, we just have to stop and like cut out this nonsense and start to behave like human beings, take decisions based on human uh, humanity, and uh, don't let the machines rule, please. Uh, I can only say it here in my tiny YouTube uh, channel, but don't let the machines rule, and I mean that in the most serious way. Uh, we are, it's not for us. In the evening. When the kettle sound of tea And old Fabia Yarfira settles over me And it's your face I see And I believe that you are there In a garden when I stop to touch a rose And feel the parasol the sweet against my nose I smile and I suppose That somehow maybe you are there When I'm dreaming And I find myself away Without the warning and I rub my eyes and fantasize And all at once I realize It's morning And the fantasy is fading Like the distant stars of town My dearest dream is gone I often think there's just one thing to do Pretend the dream is true And tell myself that you are Var det ikke det fint?